On a day like today, this is a journey and a mission you wouldn't want to end. I did this um, walk from Sheerness to Dungeness, that's the idea, so around the coast, Kent coast. Um, and it's been wonderful, I started in December. I've, I've tried to capture the mood, you see, of the, of the, and each, each uh, painting is like a postcard. It's just a memory. A final stop, a final work in progress, and a chance to catch up with Nick Kelly, the long distance artist. I start off looking and saying, okay, fine, sketching, and I love all these wires and things in Dungeness, it's so, so lovely here. Um, and then when I get back, I'll sort of, I won't look so much, I'll get absorbed into the painting, then you really sort of let, let your mind go mad. He's a voice in the dark to millions around the globe as a freelance newsreader on the BBC's World Service. But behind the voice, his passion is painting. So this is totally different from being a newsreader, being out here? Just a bit, yes. Yeah. Outdoors, sunshine. And it's a cracking day to finish, isn't it? Look at this. Yeah, perfect. I mean, <laughs> goodness, what more could you want? Well, see, people don't appreciate it. We've got everything here. Um, I don't think people get out and about enough, really. Too many couch potatoes. <laughs> That's Too good. many people listening to the wireless okay. and to the news. <laughs> <laughs> the paintings go on display in April at Margate's Lombard Street Gallery to be sold in aid of a cancer charity. A celebration of Kent's coast, the newsman's elegy in paint. Robin Gibson, BBC Southeast Today, Dungeness.